to each his own, right? All right, let's get this on the road. What are your early impressions working with Howard and some of the things he's, he's trying to change and do with you guys up front? Um, Thank you. It's a little different than what you know what we used to at one, but like I said, it works. Like I said he coached in the league for, for several years and had several, several good offensive lines, so it's going to take some time to get used to the adjustments to what he does and new techniques and everything, but I mean, it's still all basically the same. You know, so it's still offensive line, you still got to use your hands and move your feet. So it's just the techniques are a little bit different than what Juan teaches, but it won't take long at all for everybody to get acquainted with it. When you say how it works, you almost have to trust his resume, where he's been, the guys that he's produced, and say, you know what, I know it's worked. Oh, yeah, I mean, you, that's all I mean, that's all you have to look at. I mean, and it's been successful. You can look at it. Like I said, he's had guys like Tariq Glenn, you know, in Indianapolis, and then, you know, like Jeff Sider and coaching those guys for years. You know, they always had, you know, a Peyton Manning quarterback, but he always had a good offensive line as well. So. It definitely works. Like I said, you got he's got a resume. You know, go back and look at the games and the film. And uh, like I said, I'm just excited, man. I'm just glad to be back to work and get to doing some fun football wise. How much? How important are these these crash courses, these early things, no pads, but just going through them? How much more important are sessions like these? Games? Well, now it is. You know, with having the lockout, we didn't have a chance to have you know to work the whole summer. We're doing the drills. You know, four, five, you know, three, four days a week. Got to cram it all in now. And I said, you got to. I mean, with having all that time off, you got to cram everything in now and get it done. There's no other way to. Like I said, to, to get it done without doing it. So, like I said, the walkthroughs and all these cram sessions and everything is probably the most important thing. You know, probably more important than putting on pads at this point right now. Usually when you have a coaching change like that, you know, it's like new sheriff in town coming in. But here you have new sheriff's in town, but the old sheriff is still in town too. So <laughs> does, that, does that make for a smoother transition, do you think? I mean, it's, uh, you know, one going to defense is, is still, you know, it's going to make practice a little more interesting when we do put pads on. But... Like I said, with us, man, new coach, old coach, we just come in ready to work. And like I said, with the resume that, you know, even with Juan, Juan's been coaching in the league offensive line for 15 years. So going from one experienced coach to another one, it's really not that bad because, you know, they have the resume, they know what they're doing, they know how they want it done, and it works. So it's not, like I said, it won't be, you know, it won't take long at all for everybody to get acquainted with it and just to keep the ball rolling. Did you have a chance to uh, sit down with, with, with him before the lockout and kind of get a sense of, of what he wanted yeah, after he looked at film of you, what he wanted? To you to do differently and that sort of thing. No, I, did, I talked to him. You know, the the two days they had lifted the lockout. You know, he called. Us, I talked to him for about fifteen minutes, but I never got a chance to actually go go sit down with him because I was in Nashville. You know, he was up there. But I talked to him on the phone for about 15, 20 minutes. You know, we talked about it. You know, he couldn't really do it till we got here, but we talked. And uh, like I said, it wouldn't. Like I said, it's not going to take long at all for us to get. You know, once we get pads on, get doing it physically. I think everybody will be acquainted with it really soon, really yeah. quick. And a lot of his the guys that he had. We're, we're smaller guys. I mean, he never. Uh, when you first saw that, you think, "Oh my God!" I mean, where do I fit in here? No, it's um. Uh, yeah, he's used to coaching smaller, even smaller guys. But I said, as athletic as we are, I think it won't be a, a problem for us right. to adjust to it. Uh, you said the technique. Is, is it a dramatic difference, or just things you need to learn? It's just like, small little things that we need to turn. Like I said, he's. With, with coaches like with Coach Mudd and, and Coach Castillo and Juan, it's, you know, they, they're good coaches because they're meticulous about the small things, and, you know, because the small things make the biggest difference, and that's all it is. It's just small changes from what we were doing to what he wants us to do now. Let me see him right there. First thing, Jesus, he can hold up okay? <laughs> you got to kind of get used to the fact that he's I mean, of, he's, most of his life he's had those problems. So. Yeah, I mean, like I said, he's, I've, I've always known about him. My dad said my dad had told me about him before because, you know, my dad played defensive line, so he's known about Coach Mudd. And, you know, you know he's older, so, I mean, that's just – that's what kind of comes with age, so you know, just kind of you just roll with it. I hope I can live that long. <laughs> Thanks, man. Uh, Thanks, man. A couple more. Um, you know, you went to Auburn. Yeah. Uh, War Eagle, of course. <laughs> uh, I graduate next week. Okay, that's what's up. War yeah. Eagle. Well, Dan, um, have you gotten a chance to talk to Casey about the uh, the national championship at all in this past couple of days? No, uh, you talking about uh, Matthews? Yeah. Uh, uh-uh, I haven't. I didn't. Uh, I didn't say nothing to him. I don't. And I'm not, I'm not one of those guys that tries to rub anything in, yeah. but I haven't really said too much to him. I didn't even like I said we haven't done anything versus defense yet like that. So, mm-hmm. but I'm sure once the season starts, I'll bring it up. And, right. Yeah. Because I still mess with those guys with Cooper and uh, with Riley and uh, Ci, uh-huh. for beating them in Florida when they Absolutely. were down there. Absolutely. Yeah. It'll, um, uh, it'll come. It'll come. Mm-hmm. What do you think? Uh, you know, Cam left. Nick Fairley. How, it's gonna be tough. What's the team gonna be like this year? I, cu- I watched like half a quarter of the spring game, and they're gonna have. I mean, it's, they got work to do. Like I said, mm-hmm. losing guys like Cam and Nick, you know, two you know, first-round draft picks like that, great guys. You know, you got to you gotta bring in a lot more to replace them. But mm-hmm. Coach Chizik's a great coach. He'll find a way to get it done. You know, they probably won't go undefeated, but they'll, they'll definitely be in the running for the SEC West in the championship again. What do you think about uh, Zimba and Pugh going to uh, Carolina to play with Cam? Oh, Pugh, Pugh went down there too? Yeah, he got, no, he got signed as a, a an undrafted agent. free agent. Okay. I knew about Zimba. I talked to Lee um, during, you know, during the lockout. I kept in touch with him. Mm-hmm. And he's, uh, he's going to fit in good down there with them and the coaches they have in that system. And like I said, I, I think he's going to get a chance to play because I think I got a couple guys banged up. 
But I didn't know that uh, P was down there. They said he, fit, you know, they had the same kind of center like him with uh, with Khalil that's already down there, the mm-hmm. smaller, you know, sort of smaller guy. So I think it would be a good fit for both of them. I think they'll both end up, you know, not making the 53-man. I think they'll be on practice squad and, and be on the team. Gotcha. Cool. Appreciate it.